thoughts on the back of our head. You know, we're, we're amateurs. It's an amateur game. We, we train. We train hard. But, you know, when we go out there and represent our country, you know, you're testing yourselves, you know, physically and skill-wise against, a, against a, you know, a professional outfit, albeit with compromise of, of rules, you know. But, yeah, that's in the back of the head. It's a, there's a great satisfaction in that. Obviously, there's a great satisfaction in winning full stop. And I think that there is one of the things that we wanted to do in, in this series was just we wanted to win, you know. Obviously, it was a home series too in front of, of two, two fairly large crowds. And as I say, thanks for we've done that. Look, all, all we wanted, Michael said it, all we wanted to do today was put in a performance that, that you know, was worthy of the players and was worthy of the work that we had put in in the last uh, number of weeks. Some people were saying, look, the Australians in the last few series were even better kickers than, than our guys. We wanted to make sure that, you know, we showed how good kickers we were. It's a very, very enjoyable game to play, uh, mainly because, as I mentioned before, and I don't want to, I suppose, emphasise the point too much, but it's a skills-based game. I mean, it's about kicking accurately, it's about catching accurately, it's about making incisive runs, it's about shooting, it's about scoring. I think they're all great parts of Gaelic football, they're all great parts of, of AFL too. Obviously maybe it's a spectacle sometimes, it can be a bit maybe stop-start, but I think we were conscious of that as players and as management and we really wanted to put on a, a, a show today as such and, um, and really give it the respect that we deserved and I think we, we did that over the four quarters. I think sometimes, you know, there are <laughs> as, as <laughs> reactions to, to big defeats. We were, we were defeated, Ireland was defeated by 100 points to, I can't remember what it was, in 64, in, 19, or in, 2000 and, in 2005, um, by a very, very strong and very skillful Australian team. You know, if Australia were to put their best team out, there certainly, it, there would be very close games. So I don't think there's a necessity to, to tamper with the, the rules whatsoever. If Australia play their best team, which is <clears throat> what we've always wanted, what the whole series, uh, the basis of the series was about, you know, to put Ireland's best against Australia's best and, and, and have a very strong contest. And when that has happened, there's been some really competitive games in the past. Uh, so I don't think that on the basis of, you know, one, one, one very one-sided series that you should tamper with the rules that much.